Welcome back, everyone. Oh, I bet you got questions, my friend. No, no, no. Too much visibility on the street. They're listening. They're always listening. That's why I keep the dryers running 24-7. They bug my phones, read my mail. They have this place on CCTV. Replace my girlfriend with an android. The Illuminati. I know you know. And they know I know. You know? <laughs> oh, you're wondering why they haven't disappeared me. Shut down my magazine? It's because I play smart. I play along. It's a game to them, you know? It's all just a game. Oh, hi, hi, hi Leah. Don't worry, she's, she's, she's not one of them. She's in my D&D group. Role-playing is the only avenue to resist control. We do nothing, nothing! They don't tell us to. They've been conditioning us in, 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 in every kind of media for years, okay? Example, Pac-Man. That's how they see you. Just, 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 just a little head, just a mind share. And you run through the mazes, the mazes they built, sucking down their pills, the fruit. The forbidden wisdom of Eden? Never enough. And you can't shake the fucking ghosts, right? I mean, they're watching you. Their eyes are always watching you. Even beyond death. This all adds up. That's where you'll find the Illuminati. At the dark center. In the ghost house. In the labyrinth. It's right here. Just, just follow the yellow dot road. <laughs> That's all I can say. You nearly made me shit my backup flash drive. Look, who I am isn't important. What is important, what is vitally important, is raising awareness of the truth. You can quote me on that. David O. Screed, editor-in-chief, a weird non-fiction magazine. Maybe you read us. Or maybe they stumped you. I'm talking the Universal Day. Puppet governments, their shadow masters. Big Brother corporations, satanic cults, squid worshippers, the Knights Templar. Pick a card, man, any card. The wilder it is, the more out there it is, the better. Don't you get it? Put all the madness in plain view, then they call us crazy. The moral panic never lasts. We're the sheep, and they're the cooks. I'm just one voice, but I am making myself heard. Subscriptions, mailing lists, my confidential mailing lists, they are doubling month after month. This is my time, my calling. Just to warn you viewers, I'm the kind of player that tends to look around in every corner and choose every dialogue option because I'm curious as to what they have to say. And so I want to find out everything I can. But don't worry, I'm not going to read the lore things. Because that, that might take a little too long. I think I'll read those on my own time. I'm ready. I tried to run from it once. As far away as we could get. To West Virginia? My, my parents lent me the money for the Amtrak back here. see a little green checkbox comes up once you talk to Mel of that option. For a warehouse district, a dead neighborhood, this place sure gets a lot of traffic, don't you think? Not hipsters looking for rehearsal space. This is where the deeply incognito go to be found. The underground scene here, it's real deep underground, you know what I mean? People watching not your style? We got your violence, we got your rituals, check the back issues. Alligators in the sewers, giant squid washing up out of the East River, packs of wild dogs talking in Russian. I mean, this place is a, a fucking pre-gentrification spook central, huh? That's why I stay inside, man. Listen, I'm not an investigative journalist. I don't go door to door looking for trouble. I got a drop box for that shit. You want the wild stuff? Try to rock a Billy Vamp who runs the bookstore. I came here to go dark, to go native, darkly native, embedded, 
and we can almost make the rent on this place. It's condemned. In this messed up world, it might be the safest place to be. Think about that. Is some many-angled elder god really gonna make New York worse, huh? First Manhattan, then all of New York. The Illuminati took this city like a fucking virus. They kept on hammering until we let them in. Like those little porn pop-up windows that won't quit. <laughs> Corruption as deep and wide as those quote-unquote closed subway tunnels under Atlantic Avenue. Wall Street's their piggy bank. And Times Square? Strobe hypnosis. 30 milliseconds spliced in on every 1,337th frame. I have filmed it, filmed it, and gone through all the data. The exposure almost killed me with a migraine. Just ask Penny. The old Penny. She was slipping something into the chicken soup. <laughs> but I built up a tolerance to it. You're thinking I should confront the authorities, make sure my voice is heard. I can't hide in the laundromat forever, right? Well, I can. I can hide in the laundromat forever. And the magazine is my voice, my insurance. Look outside. What's even real? They changed the rules, made a new reality. It's all fake. Just boxes. Boxes and a dark sky. I'm ready to go home now. You want to talk about dark days? Listen. We are in the long shadow of 2012. It's hanging over us like, uh, like the fucking Death Star, okay? I mean, I'm not saying it's the end. The Mayans were crazy mothers, but they weren't stupid. 2012 is the beginning of the end. A signal point when all the lines start to come together. And you will wake up one day, my friend, and find the world has turned into a screaming hell planet while you slept, thinking you were safe in your little bubble, okay? That's the risk you take every time you close your eyes. Day to day, it's like fucking Russian roulette. The gun of truth. The magic bullet pressed to the skull of the future. But you know, I salute you. I mean, I couldn't do it anymore myself. I couldn't, I couldn't take the uncertainty. So I really cut back on sleeping, as much as I can, okay? I use, uh, vitamin supplements, energy drinks, nicotine gum, pop rocks, hairspray, that kind of shit. Not here! Not here, right? There's only so much I can tell you. Living in their backyard, it pays not to lay a turd on the doorstep, you get me? But look, everything our nation has ever done, the good and the bad, it's all in their scheme. Their pyramid scheme. <laughs> they, they pulled some, some body snatchers level shit on this country, man. The Senate, the Army, the banks, the law firms, Hollywood, Fort Knox, Cheyenne Mountain, Disneyland for Christ's sake. The USA became a superpower off of the Illuminati becoming the supervillain. This already happened. What do they want? What do you give the conspiracy that has everything? Search me, my friend. I'm just trying to get by day to day on microwave ramen and paranoia. I mean, I don't hate him for, you know, anything other than abducting my girlfriend. But she knew the risks when she followed me down this road. And between you and me, Penny bought here? Something else in the sack. Oh, what day is it? I feel like I've been you dog, me. That guy's chose my outfit. Well, except for the undershirt. Yep, you were never here. I got it. I got it.
You know the drill. Run them through due diligence. I'm on it. Please, no head trauma. Someone ping Cassini to shut that fucking alarm off. Say, have you ever seen a person void themselves from exposure to pink noise? Get these two freaks out of here. Hi. Have you ever seen a psychiatrist or taken psychedelic drugs? Whoa, 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 don't freak out. You got a lot of narcosynthetics in your system to fast track the rapport process. So make yourself comfortable before you lose motor function in your arms and legs. Is it safe? <laughs> no, I'm just fucking with you. I'm a researcher, an experimental researcher. Zern, my schedule is triple booked, so get started 10 minutes ago. Uh, yes, ma'am. Miss Geary. Management. <laughs> Still here. Shit. Knew that. <laughs> wow. Illuminati. Always there. Okay. Today, we're going to be provoking your extra human potential. Routine tests, psychic driving, invasive procedures, auto-suggestion, and this is all gonna happen while you're under a post-hypnosis role-playing scenario. I wouldn't worry about it. I'm gonna play you a looped recording of the catastrophe in Tokyo. And then, with a little chemical assistance, your uninhibited neurons are going to work their crazy magic. I won't lie to you. This is going to be an intense out-of-body experience. Wow! I'm pretty excited myself. And subject has left the building. It's pretty exciting. I don't think I'd want him researching on me. It's all shut down. Kaiden Cho, everything. From the, the park to, to, to Arachi Tower. SDF quarantine. Good news for Tokyo, bad news for us. I thought the dragons thrived on chaos. Someone once told me the Illuminati had all the answers. They're saying a bomb. It's never just a bomb. Something worse. Something that brought the filth with it. So we fight. That's what us Templars do. I enjoy a good fight. It's just these trousers are bloody velvet. Sarah! Thank Gaia! Are you okay? A lot of this is like the beta. How are you feeling? If Zuberi was here, he'd tell us this is the worst time to argue. Well, he's not. He's down there somewhere. Sarah, get your gun. Open the gate! I'm trying! It's used for the electric somehow. The bill? No! Fuck me. Oh. My. God. Watch out! Nice shooting! How many have they got in there? It's gone viral so fast. If this gets out into Tokyo... It doesn't. We stop it here, whatever it takes. Thanks for the encouragement, Alex. Let's do this. 
it's kind of running laggy, I think, but that may just be because a lot of people are logged in right now. I don't know. Don't let it get on you. Don't even breathe in. It's reacting to us. Like it knows we're coming. This stuff can't think. It's a cancer. Cancer doesn't know you're coming, it just is. New plan. Fight chaos with chaos. Keep the bastards at a distance, then take them out. That's your plan? Well, it's a plan. You've got points, Sarah. Make every shot count. Incoming! We're gonna need to use some heavier powers. Don't hold back, right? <coughs> I was pacing myself. Listen, Sarah. You have to find Zuberi. We'll hold them here. Make a stand. In case you had noticed, I'm in somebody else's body. Apparently, I'm a girl named Sarah. Who happens to be a dragon member? This is just kind of like training, which I don't think it's possible to die here because the health bar stops at a certain number. I think it's at like 375 and it doesn't go any lower than that. arrived. Even where the filth corrupts, Gaia's power endures. Take it into yourself. Breathe it out. Will this broken body mend it? Good, good. But even Gaia will be tested by what is to come. Making a stand? Wasn't working out. Yeah, about that. This ain't looking much better, to be honest. 
Now is not the time for argument. Told you he would say that. We must reach the next platform. The gate's opening! I think that's bad news. Yep, bad news. They're not stopping! And they will not stop. This is all to hold us back. Top marks for effort. Someone has to push through. This confusion may be all the time we have. Someone? Look out! It's all coming down! That was just like the beta. It's like that for any group you choose to. If you're Dragon, Templar, Illuminati, you go through this same training scenario where you're in this girl, Sarah's body, and going through these subway tunnels. And now to this weirdness. This game really distorts reality. It blows your mind. Pineal gland, overstimulated, higher brain functions, functioning, that is great work, well above MK Ultra success rate. Hey, can I ask you, have you ever seen a jaguar tripping? Zerg! Well, yes. Look it up sometime. Hey, you better haul ass to the test chamber, jump through a few hoops. Oh, oh! And you may be feeling some discomfort from the microchip that I grafted to your spinal column. No worries, though. I mean, it's, it's, it's going to fade, really. And as your doctor, I'd caution you 
strongly caution you, don't try removing it, okay? And this is a good point to stop in the video. And I'll see you in the next one. Till then, take care and have a great day.